All right, so we, we send her in. That's a good girl. Here. Good. So then I'm going to maybe put this on. Take it on. In she goes. Good crate. And then I shut the door. So she's in there. And you go and, you know, you, you go and you do your thing. Yeah. Whatever. And just put this away. So I like to have a, a what I call a grab collar, flat collar on. Once we switch over to a, a slip collar or a choke collar later on, you won't have that on in the crate. You just have the, slip, the flat collar flat as a grab collar. So now here's how I, how I condition them to come out of the crate. So you got the right angle on this. So we're going to, I, so she's all excited and all that kind of stuff. So I open the door, I reach in and I back her up. She's not going to sit. I'm going to wait. She will. Yes. Then I feed. See how far back she is? Yeah. Then I invite her out because now I'm ready. I get a hold of that grab collar. I put the leash on. I have more food. I, I shape her into a sit and she sits again. Okay. okay. So I want you to try. So the three, she's in. There's three steps. You, you, re, you just put the door, the door open just okay. enough that you can get your hand in there and give her food. She's going to be hungry anyways because there's a good chance she's been in there, whatever, two or three hours. And yes, she has to pee, but that's okay. She will not likely pee in the crate unless you've left her for six or seven hours. But even so, you've got to keep the... Yeah, just toss it in. You've got to keep the same system in place. Consistency matters. Okay, so then this time... Yeah. I am you still have food. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Open the crate. You open the door. Yeah. And you, you shove your hand in so you can move her to the back. Got closer it. to the, Yeah. And there she's already sitting. If she's sitting, that's fine. Then you grab her collar at the same time. So she stays sitting. See, she's not coming out until you invite her. And then you invite her. Get her to sit right away again. Sit. Sit. And feed. Yes. Good. And then you take her to the door. That's exactly how you do it, over and over and over again, so that pretty soon when you approach the crate, she's going to be sitting down automatically. Right. Right? Not freaking out. Not freaking out. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next chapter.